You're watching HSN and I'm Suzanne Runyon and welcome to Suzanne, yeah, that's me, Gets Crafty. You know, I've been a crafter for a really long time since actually I was a wee little girl and it's one of my true passions and so I love it that we have a dedicated show for those of us who either are creative or daggone it, you haven't been creative for a while and you wanna be. This is the place for you. Now in the next three hours, I have seven brand new items that were saved just for you and I tonight. You have not seen them earlier today. One of those items is an invention that one of those awesome companies we are memory keepers were able to do for me because I said gosh we used to do this years ago could somebody make this again and they did and that is my top pick so that's going to be coming up we'll give you a sneak peek in just a second but first let me give you a look at one of the other items coming up in this hour because it's jam-packed finale again three big hours we got a lot to get to so guys here it is from diamond press I want you to see it this is the floral insert alphabet dies and they are fantastic they look great we're just going to give you a quick little peek at them they're super cool there it is right there they're these awesome awesome dies now here's the scoop on them because everybody wants to know hey what's the story on these we're down to the final 1000 these are super limited they're brand new today you get 52 dies and you're gonna get the blank folder to go with it we'll talk about those later you know what i love about them is you never run out of an e or if you're spelling the word mississippi you never run out of an i or an s <laughs> and i also love it because you you can use whatever print pattern paper that you want to say anything you want. So it gives you tons of versatility. Those are coming up. Don't forget, we have five flex pays on everything today. So take advantage of it when it comes to craft goodies. All right, here's my top pick. Now, there is something that I had on years ago and I started crafting on television back at our sister network, QVC. And I said, okay, can they come up with this thing that I remember from a gazillion years ago? And it's not that glue pin. Go to the left, it's part of it, but the rest of the story is right there. Okay, those things are magical. Now here's what happened. I said, I, we, we did this item years and years and years ago. Could anybody kind of recreate it and make it even better and smarter? So here, and you guys do not miss out seeing this. I am telling you, this is from We Are Memory Keepers. And what it is, it's an envelope maker with tear guides. Now wait till you see how this works. It's insane. You'll make seven different size envelopes, even the slimline envelope. You know how everybody wants the new slimline envelopes? But you can make them with things like pictures from catalogs, pictures from magazine, maps, freezer paper. You can now make envelopes out of literally almost anything you can get your hands on. And they have completely taken it to a whole new level. And literally, you're basically tearing it to get them done. And then you get the glue stick to put it all together, which is amazing, right? So that's coming up. It is 100% brand new. It's a new creation. And I'm so excited for you to see it. Order that one early, because I think that's gonna be a quick sellout. Because once you see how cool it is, you're gonna be like, oh yeah, I can make a, a, a slimline envelope out of a newspaper, I'm in. All right, well now it's time to talk about our very best value of the day. And Anna Griffin, who we all know, she's a rock star when it comes to design, has done something that absolutely no one has ever done before. She's taken a three-step process it and made it into one brilliant idea. So let's look at it. technology. It is so exciting what Anna has done and I think she has just absolutely blown it out of the water. What is this all about? So I want you to hang with me to really understand how cool this kid is and then Anna's going to be joining us live from her studio in Atlanta. All right so I want you to think about this. This is an Anna die cut. It's a die cut and it cuts out beautiful shapes. This is one of Anna's embossing folders. It's gorgeous. It's an embossing folder. And then imagine if you had some of Anna's st stamps or any stamps. Well, imagine if all three of these concepts were now in one, emboss, or excuse me, die cut, emboss, and stamp at the exact same time. That's what makes this difference. This is three steps. This is a whole lot of work right here. She's put them all together, and now that is what these stamps, embossing, 
die cutting do. That's what you're getting in this incredible collection. And there's 21 of them. This would be, what, 63 pieces down to 21 pieces. And they're absolutely gorgeous. So you get these brand new stunning dies. They're called impressions. And they do what's called a deboss. It's still actually like texture. It's the flip side of embossing, but I wanted to explain it as simply as I could so you could really understand how brilliant this actually is. Then what she did, you want really beautiful inks. She's put together eight great stunning in her color palette beautiful pigmented ink pads that come with it. Because remember, you're die cutting, you're embossing slash debossing, and you're stamping basically all in one pass. Plus you get the gorgeous box, the magnetic plates come with it, and you're gonna get obviously and always gorgeous instructions. We also have an auto ship on this, guys, so you're gonna get more goodies down the road. We'll talk about that in just a second. But I gotta get Anna on the air with me. She has done it again, absolutely came up with a fabulous and really, Anna, quite frankly, technically such a hard idea to take those three concepts and to divide them or put them all together into one. That is so cool. Right. Yeah, well, thanks, Suzanne. I've missed you today. I've been standing in this spot for 21 hours. And I just want to say that it's been, like, you have been missed in this uh, amazing craft day. So it's really a fun oh, thing you. to get to shut it down with you in the next three hours. You're going to see baby. me a bunch of times. Uh, but yes, we have had so much fun working with this brand new innovative impression die that's going to impress ink into the paper to create a letterpress effect. It's also going to blind emboss those designs into the paper to create a Dresden-like embellishment. You're able to, for the very first time, apply rubber stamping ink, pigment ink, to the face of a metal cutting die that has a very special coating. And that very special coating is something that feels very matte, right? It actually has a waxy type surface that's not gonna come off, but it is gonna receive the ink. So you will stamp the color into the die for the very first time, run it face down into your paper, in, through your whatever machine that you have at home, and you're going to create an incredible impression that looks like it's been part of a really beautiful stationary process where we're, in, we're pushing the ink into the paper. There's no drying time, there's nothing that you have to do. The pressure is even because of the machine that you're using. We're, we're, there's no reason that you actually have to line up a die anymore. You don't have to worry about having a great stamping day, which is something I love to talk about, which is, wow, you know, when you're getting, when you've got your groove, and you're crafting and your stamping is going really well, I say, keep going, make a lot of things, <laughs> bank them away. This is something that is completely easy and foolproof. And you can use all of the inks that you actually already have, but we gave you some beautiful ones to get started with. Inside this box, you're also getting, like with those 21 dies, you're getting this instruction sheet that's going to unlock three beautiful finishing school classes, which is our learning curriculum for all the products that we have here exclusively on HSN. You can log into finishing school, see how to use these, learn tips and tricks, create three projects, and look inside the project box at everything me and my team have made with these incredible dies. Now getting 21 large engraving dies, right? These are all just just under four inches. Um, and you see the, the larger backgrounds are even bigger. You're going to be able to create the entire front of the card. You're going to be able to stamp these beautiful pigment inks on the face of those dies. And you get this great little storage box with the drawer. But Suzanne, so I'm excited to actually show you how to do this because I think I said, you know, we've missed you today. So here's <laughs> well, what, missed you too. we're gonna take that little blue ink pad, right? And then we're going to, with our impression die, you can tell that this is the, the part that's, you know, completely different than any other die in your craft cabinet because of this beautiful sort of matte finish 
on the dye. Now I'm gonna take a second color and just give this to the red, right? So we give a little crimson and we're just using the trophy design. And both of these are going to get put onto I'm gonna use my Empress Mini, which has been so helpful today because of how fast it is. So you take your impression die, you put it face down into your paper, and then both of these I'm going to die cut, I'm gonna stamp, and I'm going to emboss in one pass through my little machine and just wait for the reveal. You're just gonna love this, Suzanne. This is something, I know you craft in a very small space. Yes. And when you, you were showing off all that organization that you have in your house, and this is the perfect solution for you because not only does it save time, it's That's going brilliant. to save space. Well, it's and guys, saving money. Oh, gosh, yeah. Oh, go ahead. And, well, think about it, too. You guys, you have to understand. She, this is, and, and Anna, I just want to say this again, if you don't mind, because I want everybody to get this concept. It's new. Like, you got to gotta get your head around it. But it's, I have goosebumps. It's so wildly brilliant. What it does, it takes three things. It takes a die, an embossing folder, and a stamp, and blends them together in one pass. Hallelujah. Because this takes up a whole lot of space. So if you think about it, these are 21 of the dies you get, die stamp embossing. Okay, 21 of these. Multiply that by three. I would need all three of these to do what she did in that just that one pass. That takes up a ton of space. Imagine paying for all this over and over again. How many times have you guys done a stamp and then you try to line the die up to it and then you run it through the machine. You're like, well, that's really cute. I love it. You're not doing that anymore. Now, the cool thing is if you just want to do the embossing and the die, you can just skip the stamp part of it. So you've got many, many different ways you can do it. The thing is, it is a one-day deal, and it all ends tonight at midnight. We got three big finale hours, and then this deal is over. It's going to go up not just five bucks; it goes up to one forty-five. It is so worth it, even at one forty-five. How clever and beautiful the results are at one nineteen ninety-five. It's even better. Then you have five months to pay it off, but you will get it right away, which is fantastic. The results are there. Look at all those layers. Some some of them have just been debossed or embossed and die cut. Some have had all three steps put to them. So you've got tons of variety, tons of ways that you can use this. It is 100% absolutely brilliant. Now I do have a question from earlier today, Miss Anna, and I promised Paula at 4 p.m. in the afternoon, I do on Tuesdays a little preview to what's happening in the crafting world and a preview to my HSN online live show, which is usually at 9.30 on Tuesdays. And Paula had a question for you. Are you ready? Yeah. She said, can you print and dye on fabric with the Today's Special? Oh, what a good question. I know, right? Well, be, well, it does transfer a pigment ink, all right? And so what I know about printing or stamping on fabric is that you want a dye-based ink. And so we don't recommend using the dye ink because it will damage the, um, the, the face of the special coating that's on these mm. impression dyes. Now, what I was doing was just doing the blind emboss. So I, I, I think if you, would, if you could use a water-based ink on this, on the dye, onto the fabric, it's not gonna be permanent, but I think it would create the impression I would definitely start out with a piece of fabric that I didn't care a lot about, like my test fabric, uh, a nice, you know, smooth cotton with a nice hand to it. That might get us there. Um, you know, it's it's all worth an experimentation because Suzanne, we took out our um, our go press and foil machine uh, yesterday, and we started looking at what happens when the when we apply Ooh. that heat transfer foil oh. to the impression die nice. and you actually get a perfect you know a beautiful uh transition for it and you know there's we've just been trying all kinds of tricks and uh so there this is that beautiful gunmetal gray wow that is something just lovely and so you have that 
engraving art that we are so famous for. Yeah. And now you can engrave those designs into the paper of your choice. Hey guys, I want to mention the auto ship because of course we all love it when Anna does her auto ships because you want the fun to keep on coming. There's three of them that will be included if you sign up for the auto ship. That's September. So you're going to see the first shipment is September. It's called Glorious Impressions Inks and Dyes. So you're going to get a whole bunch more dyes, a little more thematic, but look at those beautiful pigment inks. They're gorgeous. The one after that's going to be December. So we there's December. Oh, I love it. All the Valentines, the sweet lacy looks, the hearts. And the last one's going to be in March. So that's your March. Now, the auto ship, when it comes to you, don't worry. You can slow it down. You can cancel it. You can do whatever you need to do. But you will not get the auto ship once it is completely sold out. So you won't have an opportunity for that when it's gone. Now, I want to walk over here because she has some extra special treats. And there's two of them that I want to make sure you're very aware of. Because one of them is almost completely gone. You're going to see Anna throughout the evening because she rejoins me tonight work with her Empress Mini, which is adorable. I have 180 left of the Mini. So when you see her using that little cute machine, it's got the same power as the big Empress. That's sold out, but it's the little guy. So it saves space, but it's absolutely such a powerhouse. You use it with a Today Special. You use it with embossing folders. You use it with dies. You can do that. No problem. You get this entire kit. Last 180 left. That's it. We also have this this collection, which is really fun, that works back to today's special. This is going to be the 48-piece foil and card envelope collection. So you get all the bases and all the envelopes you need in this great little box. That's still available. I want... Oh, is it... No, oh, I'm sorry. Oh, I thought there was 180 when I started. There's only a hundred, less than 100 of the machines. So you got to grab this one now. I wouldn't wait any longer. This I wanted to stop at because she is the first person of all the wonderful partners we have who finally came out with a huge 50 pack of slimline cards in only the quality that Anna does and the matching envelopes. Yay, yay, yay. You don't have to use business envelopes. <laughs> you actually will get the envelopes. You get the card bases. Obviously, it's designed to go back to the today special, but it's going to work for any of you who are really into those slimline cards. Then we have your traditional card size as well. That's another 50 pack. You can ask about that, but the slimline and the machine do not wait any longer for those. I know Annie, you got a ton more to show us. I just wanted to make sure we got that in before your little empress is gone. Workhorse. It's got a plate system that is four and a quarter by um, seven and a half. So you're getting your full, if you've got the, the beautiful 3D decorative borders that we had on tonight, they are going to work with your Impress Mini. I'm creating a new impression. I'm making the um, impression die where we're stamping the French rose onto a French rose piece of paper. And the, the reason I keep using the little mini machine is because it's just so fast. It's quite the workhorse. It's like the thing that's um, going to give you speed in your crafting. And just look, Suzanne. I'm turning it into my personal printmaking machine. I'm doing that in a way that the ink is pressed into the paper. And what's incredible right here is that you see that it's not coming off on my finger. I'm not waiting to heat set the ink, right? That's what's happening. We're creating a letterpress effect. And with each impression, we are able to create just the right type of embellishment with just this beautiful subtlety, whether you're doing it as a blind emboss or pressing the ink into creating your own embellishments from teacups to butterflies to beautiful backgrounds. And then all the amazing things that are masculine in this set. We did um, two different styles in the 21 different dyes that you're getting. So in the masculine ones, you're getting the airplane and the football and beautiful engravings that match our gentleman's study um, line of products. There's all those foot Balls, Suzanne, I know you're a big fan. And so here, you know, you can stamp them on colored paper and die cut them and get all that beautiful embellishment into one piece of cardstock. So yes, I think um, we've started testing even more things for you today, Suzanne. Mm -hmm. I'll show you one more thing, which I thought was pretty interesting, was that we started do doing the impression 
on um, vellum, on vellum. and Pretty. that worked beautifully. I love the embossing on the vellum. We actually um, use the uh, actual embossing powders pressed into the design as well to get oh. that little bit of raised metallic look with a with a gold embossing powder. That's so gorgeous. those things work like a charm. Wow. <laughs> and you know, Anna, let's really talk about this though. If you guys had to buy 21 stamps, 21 of our embossing folders and 21 of our gorgeous dies, you're spending a ton of money. It takes up a ton of space. This is taking all three of those and making it one pass. So I'm so glad you guys are loving this tonight. Do not miss out on it because the price and the whole deal ends in just a couple of hours. You're gonna love using these. You'll love the pigment inks. You can use the inks on other stamps if you want to. You remember, you can use these just as the die that gives it that impression without the inks. So if you don't want to ink it up you don't have to but you'll still get that beautiful effect of texture and you get the actual die cutting as well it's brilliant it's such a cool concept and i love the fact that we're launching it it's exclusive you can't find it anywhere else and of course you've got this one day deal plus you get the gorgeous box and they always give you the best instructions but what i really love is her finishing school and if you guys haven't been a part of that you'll have access to really in-depth classes to max this out to really understand and learn how how brilliant this is. So Anna, I think that's such an important point because a lot of people have not been to one of your finishing schools online. And I love it because you guys really walk us through these ideas. Right, it is such a passion project of mine. This, you know, because I am, I'm an avid consumer. When I buy something, especially something that I've seen on TV, and I get it home and I open the box, I really want to feel just like I do in this moment. Where, wow, I really love those. I want to understand how to do them. So, finishing school is was created to help you to lend an, a helping hand in creating composition to learning how to use the things that we make so be beautifully for HSN. All of our products are featured in these um, these videos and really you pick, uh, you know, you'll pick by subject. So the impression dies, the classes, you're going to get three of those. You're going to get a beginner project and an uh, intermediate project and an advanced project and with all of that you're also going to get a look inside the project box so an up close look at a project like this wow. that where the impression dies jump off the card and right on to the scrapbook page so you're going to be able to use these in ways that you have not thought possible okay guys so here's what we're gonna do Anna I'm saying goodbye to you only momentarily because she's coming back, and Anna, we got some good surprises. In fact, we have a brand new item that was not on the air today yet, right? Right. And stick around. Very exciting. And we have the Explore Air. Did you see, Anna, did you see the price in the Explore Air too? Guys, it's incredible. We have the lowest price, the best way to ever get a Cricut cutting and emboss or cutting machine it's coming up all right let me show you these one more time before they're sold out don't forget we have the 48 piece this is the pre-printed with foil cards which is a ton of cards 48 and you get the matching envelopes use them with all your other good goodies from anna or any other of our great partners or of course it goes back to the today special here's an update on the mini empress this little baby is so cute i love it look at look at this look at this size but it's a tough little sucker it's mini but super mighty like it's all the stuff we love on the big guy it's just miniaturized you get the folders you get the sandwiches you get you already get um dies that come with it and there's an emboss two embossing folders as well there's 60 left this is almost totally sold out and then once it's gone it's going to be a kind of a while and then i just want to show you because this is great the real rage in card making right now is these elongated what's called slimline cards anna has done in her beautiful weight cardstock envelopes and of course the card bases and so if you guys have really gotten into the slimline card design this is awesome just to have a 50 pack it's just ready to go also i have to tell you you've got to stick around to see what's coming up next because already how many are gone rocky 500 of my top pick were sold from just our little preview and you'll learn all about it coming back in just a moment. So check this out. Cher Eau de Couture. I'm so excited because the fragrance that I spent four years creating that I can't live without is now available to you. Cher, live on Beauty Report, only on HSN.
Discover a world of beauty like you've never seen before. Beauty Report is the insider's guide to getting gorgeous. Join me every Wednesday night for a beautiful new routine. Now that warmer weather's here, it's time to make your home a summer oasis during our Home and Garden event, May 6th through the 9th at hsn.com and all day May 7th on HSN. We have all the essentials you need to create a tranquil home for you to enjoy this summer. Plus, don't miss the premiere of Kitchen Prep with actress and cook enthusiast Laura Prepon on May 7th. It's all happening during our Home and Garden event, May 6th through the 9th at hsn.com and all day May 7th on HSN. years as I've been cooking, there have been things that I've discovered that I need, and I can't find them. So I decided to make them. I'm excited. <laughs> all of my products are solution-based. It is all about making our cooking experience easier, less stressful, more fun, being able to cook for your family, cook for your friends, cook for yourself, and making our lives in the kitchen a lot easier. Don't miss the premiere of Kitchen Prep with Laura Prepon, Friday. Shop our event, Beauty with Benefits, and you'll support cancer and careers, which empowers cancer survivors to thrive in the workforce. As our thanks, you'll get an amazing gift with purchase valued over $150 from both HSN and QVC. Catch all of these great beauty brands in support of a great cause. What's more beautiful than that? Watch and shop May 25th at 8 p.m. Eastern on HSN and 10 p.m. Eastern on QVC. By the way, that piece of cake was from our cafeteria, and I will tell you, it was absolutely delicious. Hey, I'm Suzanne Renner, you're watching my show here at HSN. Three big hours tonight. This next night, it was awesome. Okay, so when we were getting ready to do my show, and this was probably about six, maybe seven months ago, we all met, the team and I, and they said, hey, what do you want us to do? And I said, could you really kind of create some new stuff that's never been seen before? And then I kind of went back in time, and I said, man, we had this one item years and years and years ago, and I said, boy, it'd be great to do something something like it, but make it even better. And thank you, We Are Memory Keepers, because they did. And I have to say, this is the first time I've seen it in real life. I knew, I didn't know it was coming. Then I saw it on my sheet and I go, oh my God, they made it. And then I was like, here it is, and it's great. So what are, what is this crazy pile you're looking at? Here we go. This is called the Tear Guides. It's a way to make seven different envelopes, including the famous new Slimline envelope. And you get the guides to go with it. You get an alphabet to go with, you have squigglies to go with it. All of these templates you will use over and over and over again. And literally you can now take maps and newspapers and wax paper and I don't know, pictures from magazines and you can make the coolest envelopes by simply tearing them. It's amazing. So let's get into it. We've sold 600 from the preview. This is the time to do it. It's my top pick of my three hours. And you can tell that literally I am so excited to see this. By the way, you also get the glue pin to go along with it, which is great because you want to glue the envelope together. They include that. So we're going to go to Allie. And Allie, I have to tell you, because I know the gang from We Are Memory Keepers are watching as well. Thank you and all of them for making this. I am so excited <laughs> about what you're about to show everybody. You're welcome, Suzanne. Wish granted. We're happy to accommodate because this is a brilliant set of templates. You're going to love it. And imagine being able to make seven different sizes of envelopes, address them, and all without a cutting machine, without a punch, without even a pair of scissors. So these are all the different sizes you're getting, even your slimline. Slim and isn't that fun? So let me isn't that awesome? Yeah. All right, so I'm going to show you how this works. Let me scoot these out of the way. Each size template comes with, hang on, let me grab it, um, your 
envelope template. So this is how you're gonna make your envelope. You're gonna just kind of tear along this and then it's got an inner template and that's for folding it over and that's also for addressing the main address and then you can address the return address up here. So we've got everything you need in this set to make envelopes. So Suzanne, I went to a wedding reception last week of um, some friends of ours, some neighbors, their daughter got married and I have some leftover scraps from that. Um, and I wish I had had these then because this would have saved me some serious time. So watch this. Here's my scrap. I'm going to turn it this way and I'm just going to tear. <laughs> Look how easy that is. I love I'm this. I'm just tearing along the guide. How crazy is that? Isn't I'm, that amazing? I'm so excited. And all you this have to is do bad. is tear. This is amazing. This is a brilliant idea. Um, and the thing is I just move my fingers around to kind of get a little pressure and now, see, sometimes, I, you know, you have your leftovers from your paper, your uh, wrapping paper, and sure. you don't know whether you should save it, whether you should try to roll it back up on there, or whether you should chuck it or what. But there we go. So you're going to leave your template right there, and you're going to take your inner template and place down right there, and then you're going to fold. Yeah, that's the folding guide. All you have to do is fold, and super, super easy. Yep, that's the folding guide, <laughs> and we're just going to fold. And then, oops, let me get that tucked in there. And then you're gonna go a little slower than I'm going, obviously. Sure. And then we're gonna take that out. And all we have to do is glue this. And here's the cool thing about this pen, Suzanne, is this can be either permanent or removable. It depends on how you glue it. So when it's blue and you glue it while it's still blue, it's gonna be permanent. But if you wait until it turns clear and then you glue it, then it's removable. So if you wanna put a little bit right here that's removable, and wait for it to, to dry a little, then you're gonna have an envelope that is entirely, you know, shut and then you can open it and reopen it. So that's kind of oh, cool. Oh, that, now that so is let's brilliant, actually. make a liner. Oh, can this Isn't make a brilliant? liner too? Okay. So here's the liner. Yes, ma'am, it sure can. All right, so all you need to do is take your envelope guide again, your template, and you see these lines right here? Okay. This is your liner line. You're gonna move that down to the bottom of your paper right there. And then you're just gonna tear the oh, top part. So smart. Just like we did before. And we're just gonna tear along here. All right, now, hold on a second. I gotta move my fingers over. There we go. All right, and then we're gonna take a pencil and we're gonna draw right inside this inner guide here, just on the sides, straight down. And then I like to take my inner um, template and put it just inside and tear again. Just inside and tear again. And then you just tear off a little bit from the bottom. And then you just slide that right inside your envelope. And I'm kind of rushing here, but let me show you what that looks like when you're finished. And then look, you just slide that in. You've got an extra um, that matches your gift, right? Look at that. And you're ready to go. Okay, and you guys, use up your so scrap. Let me do this, Allie. Hang cool. on one second, honey. I got to give you guys a quick update on this. Do not miss out on this. It is as clever as can be. It's about half gone. And here's what happens. Ex experiment with lots of different papers. Maps. Can you, If you have an old map, it's so cool. If you find a beautiful picture, what's really neat about this is you'll learn, and it's real simple, and you'll get the idea if you've never seen this before, is what you'll learn is you'll learn when you look at a magazine, and let's say there's a beautiful bird in a picture. You rip the magazine page out, you'll learn how to position the bird so it's in the exact right spot. Or if you have a page of like flowers in a beautiful picture, you'll learn to position that magazine page perfectly to get the max look. I've taken like really hot shoes that I've seen in catalogs and then torn them to make envelopes. You can do maps, you can do old, old telephone books if you wanted to. It's crazy. You will not ever look at wrapping paper the same especially you know when you get that craft style wrapping paper that's so cool that's a little heavier oh my gosh they make amazing envelopes and guess what they are mailable which is awesome it is one of the most clever ideas and I love the fact that now you can do the slim line so if you guys have, and you can use obviously any cardstock you have any paper you want to use you can make envelopes out of anything that's the correct size that matches this and the sizes by the way Allie I want you to go through because I know there's seven different sizes I'll do it 
It's A5, A6, A7, A9, 5 inch, 6 inch, and the popular slim line. That's what you're getting. But will you do me a favor, Allie, before they're sold out? Please show how you do the addressing. And then also, we've got some extra kind of embellishing templates that you guys have included. Yes, let me show you a couple of samples of those really quickly, Suzanne. So here's what I would do. I would grab my envelope, and this is uh, not the matching one, but you have a matching inner um, guide for each size. And you would just simply place that on there, and then you would write, and you know, send to, this is glitter paper, so my pen isn't working very well on it, but let me show you some samples. Here is what the stencils look like. Oh. Right down here. This is some stamping we added in addition, but look oh, at wow. those stencils right there. Isn't that cute? That's so you can line so your cute. stencils up right inside this guide and you can get perfectly straight lines, right? Happy stuff inside. Oh. And then here's an example of the scrolls of the, the little designs that you can add. You oh, see that you can it. go all the way around, create a border. You can create a scroll across the top and little designs all over. So you have a lot of different options available to you. Um, but I just wanted to show you as well, Suzanne, some of these, like you talked about the materials. In addition to text weight, this is like lightweight pattern paper, magazine. Wait, show this the magazines. Magazine. I mean, how, Look at, how cute. Look at the interior yeah. of that. Show them how cute that interior is. Like, come on, is that the cutest envelope ever? <laughs> Isn't that cute? I love it. There's avocados and <laughs> yeah, there's, it's just a magazine page. Newspaper ads, right? Cute. You're recycling, guys. You're you're totally saving the planet. Calendar pages. Oh, a calendar right? page is a Here's great your idea. With the calendar page. Oh wait, hey Allie, my producer Rocky wants me to jump in. I got to do it. Wait, I, I want you to stay right there, Allie. Don't um don't stop. Just stay right there because I want you to show all the examples. I have 844 left, and then this is completely sold out. What is the one in front of you? I'm dying to know the one in that has that looks like a grocery bag. Right in front of you, that one. Oh, yes, ma'am. That is a grocery bag. Oh, please. Right there. How cute. That is a grocery bag. <laughs> right? <laughs> I mean, we're talking use up whatever you've got, yeah? So here are the different sizes so you can see them. This is your A9. This is your slim line. This is your six. This will fit a six-inch card. Cute. Here's your five. I think this is five and a half. Here's your A6 or A5, sorry, A6, and A2. Oh, how cute. So we've got all the popular card sizes, envelopes for those. Um, and oh, I gotta show you this, Suzanne. So I really love using envelopes oh, to make stop. mini albums to, okay. for memory keeping. Okay, this is, uh, this is a garden um, album. So you can pop the seeds from your garden into these envelopes that you make. And this is just, oh, you know, here's a, another paper bag. You know, this is glitter paper. So you can use this for memory keeping, for card making, for scrapbooking. We've got a scrapbook page right here too. If you like to add additional photos, um, you can make an oh, envelope. This is made out of vellum cute. and that tears really easily. Oh, yeah, stop it. Can add extra I photos. So a little, a and it's a little interaction too. Okay, guys, these are totally going to sell out. And again, yeah. you're getting all the templates. And the cool thing about templates are you use them over and over again. And really, once you get going and you start, you just start tearing that tear. This is the slim line, which I, I kind of want to steal. But uh, once you get that technique down, and it's very easy, you tear it. No scissors, no dies, no machines, no nothing. You slap it down, tear, tear, tear. And they're thick enough that they're going to give you a nice crisp tear on the edge. And you are going to go crazy. You'll never look at any magazine or catalog or wrapping paper, the same, because you know you have these all at home ready to go. And I'll tell you what I really like too, um, Allie, is even with the guides for writing the addresses, even if you're using our traditional envelope that's pre-made, those are really helpful even if you don't make your own envelope. Oh yeah, for sure, Suzanne. Um, it's, it fits you know, all your standard size envelopes so you can absolutely address things. I've got my slimline guide here. That envelope. <laughs> All right. Hey. And it is sold out. Allie, thank you for hanging out tonight. Um, wait a minute, Allie, you coming back? Do I have anything more with you? Uh, yes, later on uh, during the 11th. Give them a tease. Hour. Give them a tease. The button press. Yeah. Oh, that wasn't a tease. You actually told oh, them what it was. We're doing the button press. On... Oh, sorry. <laughs> I gave it away.
Pass out of the bag. Okay, there you go. <laughs> yes, and what's happening with the button press, you make the round buttons, but for lower than the price of the original round button press, they've actually thrown in a whole bunch of square buttons now, so you can make cute little buttons for birthday parties and all that kind of good stuff. Okay, look at this next collection. Oh, I love it. We're now gonna move on to one of our favorites as well. It's Diamond Press. We've got two choices. We have the birthday collection over here. So this is all birthday, birthday, birthday on this side. Massive fun collection. And on the other side, this is gonna be what's called the butterfly collection, and it's huge. So what this is, is either one will make, listen to this, 50 cards, 50 cards. You get all the cards, all the envelopes, you get stamps, you're gonna get the holder. So let me show you how this works. They've come up with this cute little organizational system. So when you've gotta make a card, there's all of our stamps, here's all your extra little layers, and then more cards, and then all the little envelopes, all up in this neat little notebook. Isn't that adorable? So of course we're gonna to go to Beth Kingston because she's gonna walk us through this brand new kid. Hi Beth. Hey, friend. Hey, sister, good to see you. You too. This I love when you guys do these little notebooks. I can't stand it. They're so cute. I do too. And this many cards for $27.95 is a little bit like overwhelming for me because there's so many good things. So I'm just going to have Don zoom in really quickly. We're going to start with the butterfly garden. I am obsessed with these patterns, obsessed. So what you're getting is 50 envelopes in two coordinating colors. You're getting five different patterns of cards, 10 of each. You're getting these beautiful florals. I love this black and white um, stripe. Look at these really fun butterflies. And then you're getting two full sheets of stamps. Just a little note, best wishes, happy birthday, thanks. Here's what's cool though. You're getting 50 of these, um, they'd be called journaling squares or title blocks. That's gold foil on there. And guess what? The stamps are made to fit perfectly inside there. So this is an, all you need is an ink pad and some adhesive and you are ready to go and make these. And these have beautiful like floor de -lis, uh, beautiful patterns on them. So you're taking this card set and you're turning these into things like this. Again, all you need is to stamp your um, sentiment, add a little adhesive. We added a cute little bow, but this took just a few minutes and it looks just as gorgeous as if you spent a couple hours making it. I mean, look at how fun these are. Suzanne, look at, um, I think this maybe was Ashley's card. She colored in the gold foiled image. Isn't that gorgeous? That's think pretty. of how easy this, if you are a beginning crafter, this is for you. If you are an advanced crafter, but very busy and just need sometimes to make a few quick cards, this is for you. You're getting 50, that's, <laughs> five zero. That's amazing. With all these cool, isn't that? And look at this double um, title box. Look at how gorgeous yeah. that is. Yeah. I mean, just the little title squares alone with the gold foiling. So what's great about this, Suzanne, you, I know you love to use your scraps, so do I. You know, when you have like little bits of onesies, twosies of flowers, look at just added, adding that to the card at just that much more. You have, we all have die cuts that we love. We all have beautiful die cuts. Look at how gorgeous oh, wow. this is. Just adding two butterfly die cuts. I wow. mean, the possibilities are endless. You can color them in, you can die cut them. Look at this one where um, she turned it into a stand-up card. Oh, cute. Right? Isn't that so fun? Okay, so this is the butterfly garden. Let's shift on over here to the birthday set because, and here's the thing, it's called birthday, but to me, it's more celebration because the stamps say things like, thanks, hello, congrats, hip, hip, hooray, wow, you did it. So this could be for any special, any celebratory occasion. You know I love the rainbow. Um, look at this card with the balloon animals on the background. <laughs> oh, God, look how cute it is. So again, you're getting 50 cards. You're getting the coordinating notebooks. You're getting the two sheets of stamps. Um, Don, if you can scroll, scroll down here to the bottom. You're getting the title squares, but look at these. These are in full, bright, gorgeous living color, but again, with that gold foil on top. So it's just making them that much more special. And again, you're taking what you've already got in your stash, just adding a sentiment and a couple, look at how, look at how fun that is. Seconds, Suzanne, this will take you like two, three minutes. Look at this one where she die cut a vellum heart into the center. I mean, so cute. Here's one where she cut the garland out of one of these and made like a little extra embellishment. So essentially you're getting these for like 50 cents a card. And in reality, you could make much more than that because I think I have one sitting around somewhere. You could take one of these and just pop it on a plain old piece of, you know, 
pink pattern paper and make something beautiful. I mean, it just takes an extra little bit and you're turning this into something amazing. This would be great for um, graduate uh, teacher gift, end of the year teacher gift. This would be a great birthday gift. If you've got a crafty kid getting ready to go to college, send them with one of these and an ink pad and some adhesive and they can send, you know, thank you notes to grandparents or thinking of you cards to their friends. I mean, I'm just so obsessed and we haven't even, you mentioned it briefly, but look at how stinking cute this binder is. It's everything <laughs> you need, right? No right. more, oh, I bent my envelopes. Oh, I can't find the matching envelope to go with the card. Oh, where are the stamps <laughs> that fit these title blocks? Everything is in here together. These are closable, they're reusable. So once you use them, you can refill them with other things. I mean, it's just so fabulous. It's I love it. Super so, it's super cute. And yeah, you know, how often do you, and it ha happens to me all the time. I love to make handmade cards. Don't have the time to do all the fancy, pull out all the yeah. stuff. I just need to yeah. knock it out. But I still want it made from by hand. You know, I want to do it myself. Yeah. And I think if you're an absolute beginner, I would 100% recommend this. If you're more oh intermediate or advanced, then take all the other stuff you own and use it and blend it in with it, which will make it go and last even that much longer. You can go to any level on this, but this is an awesome Awesome deal. So remember, butterfly, most popular right now, and absolutely gorgeous colors on this. And then the celebratory birthday is the other option. All right, Miss Beth is not going very far because she's hanging out. We have something new we're going to show you next. And I will tell you, this is final quantities on this next item you're about to see. So you don't want to miss out. Now, here's what happened to me back in the day, because oh, I've been doing this for a really long time. You would go to do um, like anything and you'd want to say you know congratulations and you'd get a sheet of stickers that were pre-printed alphabet letters that were yes. pre-printed and you would always run out of a letter that you needed it would happen at the worst time so you're thinking well what do i do well imagine if you just had dies and you could have as many s's you need for the word mississippi as you could ever imagine that's what this is all about and they're these cute chubby shapes which i love so what are you getting in this collection and again final quantity again on this you are getting 52 dies and you're getting the blank folder of course you're going to use it with your marquee machine which i don't know guys i know we have it floating around because i saw it out there but maybe we can just bring it out real quick because you'll see um uh, beth working with it too but beth these just turned out absolutely so cute oh i love this little cute banner oh, too so cute. that's okay, a here's the amazing thing about this is I love patterned alphabets. This is actually, Suzanne, four different alphabets in one. And let me show you what I mean. So you're exactly right. You're getting the block alphabet dies, but look at what you're getting in addition. You're getting these little inserts right here and I'll flip it over so we can see a little better. So you're getting actually three additional sets. So you're getting the starburst alphabet, the ivy alphabet, and the modern floral alphabet. What does that mean? You take these regular dies, you add the insert, Suzanne, look, oh, you're customizing it just with this little pop of embellishment, right? You're just oh, making great. these really fun, gorgeous cards, again, with scraps of cardstock. By the way, how many sets have you seen that have something for mom and something for dad in the same set? That's what we have here. So I smart. can't wait to show you how these work, but you're exactly right. You can use them as is. Where are you going to find a sentiment that says squawk? Nowhere. <laughs> <Exactly>. <laughs> You can, right? You can make your own. Or how about this? You, you slay. Here's a perfect example. It shows all the different patterns. Suzanne, so you have full alphabets oh, gosh, with this great leaf. that's clever. Full, right? Isn't this so clever? So let me really quickly show you how it works because I know we don't have a ton of time. Okay. Oh, by the way, Suzanne, you were talking about the marquee. This is one of the few sets we are, so, I think maybe the only set we've got today that actually works in the original diamond press. So if you still have the smaller diamond press, the you can get this one. and you can, I think it's really right, so cool. Okay, so I cut out the word ahoy. And by the way, it comes with a small folder, but I was able to cut out, come here, little paper. I was able to cut out the whole word using one of my bigger folders. So don't let the little folder stop you from getting a bunch done. Anyway, you just run it through really quickly. I know we're running out of time. So much. So, good so you cut the letter first. You cut the letter first, you find the um, shape that you want to go with. And what's really great about diamond press is it's got a little chart on this piece of paper that's like the half circle is for the C and the O. Run it through. Look at how quickly that pops out. Okay, I am so Look in it. love with this. Look at it, right? Okay, let me show you this. Cause again, you know, we love our scraps. Here it is oh, gosh, cut out, so cute. fun paper, Suzanne. 
It's the negative. Okay. Oh my gosh. Think, yes, of course. You and by the way, never... we always get this question, you guys. Everybody always wonders, can I use it in any machine? Yes, you can. Do we have Marquee, which is one of my all-time favorites? Yes, we do have this in four colors. But think about it, really, um, Beth, you're doing one, two, three, four, five different looks when you get this kit. Because you can do just the letters, oh. or you could add the four designs. Right. And here's the other thing, too. It works for every... You can make Halloween. You can make Christmas. You can make the, oh my gosh, this is for my scrapbookers. You know, we see all the time, hey, why don't you do more stuff for scrapbooking? This is perfection Cute. for titles on your scrapbook pages. Am I right? Yes. Here's the other thing. You know, <laughs> usually here at HSN, we have like lovely, thoughtful sentiments. If you have young people in your life, this is going to mean so much more. And you can customize to say whatever you want. If you're making projects, again, scrapbook pages, cards in another language, this is the oh, set for oh, you because you're I getting the price. I about that. I know. It's so good. I mean, there's just so many. A great, it's perfect for slimline dies. And again, you're just using your pieces of cardstock, but you're adding that extra touch or okay, they look so amazing cute. as is, right? Without the, um, without the sentiments in the middle. But I just love how easy this is. And you can make it any theme, any color, any word you want. Again, I mean, look at how fun that dad oh, is just with so a little cute. shadow piece of paper. Let me show you really quickly again the paper so that you can see exactly what I meant about. See right here? So there are all these different shapes. And when you look at it, you're like, I don't understand what this means. Real small down at the bottom, like it says this curved one, C-G-O-Q. So you don't have to guess which it's letter is this going to fit in, where does it go. And then it shows you exactly, just put it on a straight edge, right? Just put it wherever you want. And you can see really beautifully all the different patterns that are available. It's and you just know what's funny, so Beth? Fun. This is pure diamond press brilliance. It really is. Right? Because again, we've so sold good. alphabet uh, dyes before, but never ever have we done anything that is got all this variety. I mean, when I buy something, I wanted to do 12 different things basically. And this is oh, gonna yeah. allow you to do that. And I mean, it really, if you thought about it, if you just wanted to use the little dyes on other things, you could figure out how to use those to get a repeated pattern using the decorative dyes. So, you oh, can like kind of take this to a whole different level. All right, guys, we've oh, sold over 2,000. So, We're super, super busy for this. We are final quantities. We have how many left? Oh, 600. We brought in 2,600. Last 600, they're going to go. You're just seeing a couple really cute examples. I only have, look at this one. I love kind of using those and blocking on a standard size card. Yes. Here's that slim line we're talking. Everybody's crazy over slim line. Now, guys, those letters were used on something else. That's what's left that you're able to still use. The negative space, The negative right? space. It's, you never have to waste again. I uh, love, so love good. it. I absolutely love this. I think this is absolutely so darn clever. And then if you want to do, here's what I love to do. If you're having a little party and a get together, you can make a mini banner. And I make a double-sided mini banner and I actually string oh, it gosh, in the yeah. middle of my dinner table. And then people ooh and ah and you feel great about it. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, you do. Uh, this is adorable. All right, guys, we got to wrap it up, Miss Beth. I know you're hanging with me, so stay right there. She has one more yeah. item to talk about. I want to talk about this, though. The Marquis is back. Now, the little teeny one is what we started out with, and then it grew up to this guy. It is one of my, I have a lot of die cutting embossing machines, and I love them all. This one is just that really quick and easy. You don't have to figure out how many layers of a sandwich to do. You basically take the little folders, and you'll get some with it. Put whatever it is, your dies, you can use regular bossing folders, run it through, and it comes out fast and quick and beautiful. We have three colors. I have four, excuse me, I have teal, purple, gold, and look at the rose gold, isn't that pretty? So grab this machine. I'm telling you what, you'll absolutely love it. And I like it, if I'm doing a big project, I'm bringing out the electronic guys, but if I just want something really fast, I wanna knock it out, I absolutely love this. And I do have the marquee at home. Yeah, can I, I'll take it with me. Where am I going, guys? I'm going this way. <laughs> I'm never really quite sure. By the way, you're watching HSN. I'm Suzanne Runyon. What a fun night, right? It's all about creativity. By the way, this is hour number one. We've got two and three coming. Next hour, the lineup is 
Fantastic. Sara Davis is joining me in the next two hours. Anna will be back. We have a brand new item for her that was not on the air. I have a ton of new items still to come. We're going to just have a ball together. All right, now we're moving on to this little guy right here. And this, again, so darn clever. This is from Diamond Press, and it's called the Envelope Liner Nature Nesting Die Set. Now, did you see my envelope tearing system sell out, Beth? Mm -hmm. Oh, my, uh, because I bought one. Did yes. you really buy one? Yes, I bought one. Oh, you're so cute, because you're gonna love it. But <laughs> I would imagine this is going to work on some of the size envelopes that we saw in there. Well, here's the cool thing about it. So I wanna show everybody really quickly what it does, and then we'll sort of talk about the hows and, hows and whys. Perfect. So you're getting, with this original set, you're getting a triangle die, a rectangle die, and then three inserts, plus a bunch of beautiful embellishments. And what that's gonna do is we spend so much time making beautiful cards, we don't think much about the envelopes. So you're taking a plain white envelope oh, and turning it into this. Oh, wow. Right? Yeah. Or turning it into this. Mm. I mean, it's just pretty much the coolest thing ever. Here's how it works really quickly. You take your triangle and you get a choice of three. And then, oh, this is an auto ship. So actually, let me show everybody what the auto ship is first, and then I'll walk everybody through. Okay. So you're, this one is the original. You get the floral, the leaf, and the butterfly, and embellishments that go with. Then this is a year-long program. Um, in July, you're getting Celebrate that has balloons, uh, glitter, or, you know, sparklies, stripes, and then again, embellishments. Then, Suzanne, look at this pumpkin one for the oh. autumn. <gasps> leaf. Right? So, oh my gosh, wait, I, ha wait. I have to buy this kit. Wait until you see the holiday. <laughs> You're just gonna die. Okay, so this is um, September. Suzanne, look at the poinsettia. Oh my gosh. <gasps> oh my God, poinsettia, the holly, look at this snowflake, and then you get the embellishments that go on the outside of the card. Okay, then in January, like I'm already obsessed with this. In January, you get the rainbow and clouds, you get these beautiful hearts, and then you get this fun sort of lacy fleur-de-lis. Then in uh, March, we start to get real fancy and we get a little scallop edge up here. You get another beautiful floral and you get this sort of uh, crisscross oh, pattern. That's gorgeous. And remember with each, right? Isn't this so fun? And then in uh, May, you get everyday ba basics and it's these geometric shapes. But here's how it works. It's this easy. So you take your triangle and you take whatever pattern, you put it on a piece of paper and I just like to use a piece of washi tape just to sort of hold it in place. It's not sure. absolutely necessary, but Lord knows we all got washi tape laying around, right? So you put it, <laughs> put it in there, slap some washi tape on. You run it through. So you can use, I mean, Suzanne, you've probably priced before or bought before um, lined envelopes. Oh, they're crazy. They are ridiculous. Well, what if, wait, wait, well, go ahead and keep demoing, but what if I wanted to do yeah. just a beautiful gold liner i don't have to use the fancy stuff i can just use the outline no in fact i've got a couple samples of that so this is what it com comes out at and look at uh, again with diamond press i don't know if you can see look at how intricate oh the little pattern is even on the flowers and then you just if you want to do an overlay or an underlay you lay that on top and adhere it into your card i mean look at how but Beth, so what some size clips, card oh. does it do ah okay so it does a2 and A6 Euro flaps. And what Euro flaps means is that just this really nice, long sort of lean um, flap on the end, they're available everywhere. Okay. Every well, and so going back to the, sell, the sold out envelope tearing kit, then two of those sizes this will work with, which is great. Uh, yeah, which is great. And, and to your point, I'll, I'll come across it pretty soon because I have one that's just plain. But look at this one, Suzanne, with a beautiful um, pattern overlay and underlay. Absolutely gorgeous. And so, all you right, you add it to the outside, whatever embellishments you That's want. Really look at smart. that oh, put out on the inside. So it's smart. Absolutely right, gorgeous. I love this. And again, we spend so much time <laughs> making beautiful cards, and then we just sort of <laughs> toss them in an envelope. <laughs> so I love that Allie just had that the tearing thing, which now we're all going to own. But I also want to make the outside just as beautiful as the inside. Um, can we talk about this color? Look at this chalk. <gasps> wow. Oh Look my gosh, it. that's pretty. But again, with scrap. Oh, here, here's the, here's just the plain. But look at that with scrap. Wait, and can I show? Sure, can I ask you one more thing, Beth? Too, because we haven't covered no. it. Because I know there's a lot to get to. There's this rectangular piece. That's making yep. that lower part, right? Yeah. Okay. Yep, and that's the beauty of it. Here, I'll open this up so you can see. You don't even have to, like, get out a ruler and measure. You just 
uh, cut it with a rectangular die and fit it inside. That's so great. this makes it just that easy. If you're getting, if you have somebody getting married, if you haven't sent out graduation cards, I mean, look at how stunning, stunning this is with just a little mm. sheet of pattern paper. And again, it's got these beautiful die cuts that are great. In fact, these were the die cuts that some of the girls used on the cards earlier. But look at how fun that is. Oh my gosh, this is like the greatest thing ever. <laughs> All right, it's awesome. Okay guys, so hey, Rocky, can we do a quick update on this too? I don't want people to miss out on it. Um, so let me update you on how many we have left for the day. Okay guys, we okay. only have a couple thousand remaining and we already sold 1,500 earlier today. So here's your chance oh, to good. get it. And again, you know, we, and again, remember when you have all these extra pieces, you can use those on scrapbooking pages, you can use them on card yeah. faces. This is designed for the interior of the envelope, but what a clever, once again, idea from Diamond Press. Don't miss out on it, you've already seen, we've sold out of my card terror. We've sold out, well, I think we just sold out of the, uh, we sold out of the um, alphabet. Okay, there's a hundred, only a hundred left of the alphabet letter set, so you want to grab this. This is going oh, quickly gosh, yeah. as well, and super, super duper clever. All right, Miss Beth, I have to let you go for the moment. Let me see. Uh, yeah, I'll see you in a minute. <laughs> oh yeah, you're coming back with a brand new item. With something so stinking cute. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'll see you, you in a minute. Do you want to give a tease? You can't say what it is. Just give us a tease, a hint. It's it's um summery. It's got it's got cuteness and toucans and flamingos and stuff. It's good. Okay, so good. good. All right, we'll see you then. <laughs> <laughs> that was a good tease. All right, guys, stay right there for this, too. This is brand new today. We've already sold, what, maybe two, two, 2,500 of them? So, no, we've sold 2,000 at this point. So, again, real busy for that. All right, so let's move on. We've got so much to do, right? I have so many guests. I got a lot of people hanging out with us. Now, come on, I'm going to show you a sneak peek of what's coming up in this.